Hey there guys, how you doing? Matty B here from the High Performance Centre. Still talking about wetsuits. Today we've got the Rip Curl Flash Bomb series. For me they're the Rolls Royce of wetsuits in the Rip Curl range. Rip Curl, great company. A lot of research and development, almost a tradition in Australia. What I love about the, the new Flash Bombs is you can get it in three options. You've got it with your chest zip, which is real popular. You've got your zipless option. What I really like about the zipless option is there's no flush whatsoever. The zipless suit really seals you in. They've made the cuffs tighter on all three of these suits. And then if you want to go super luxury, you do have the flash bomb uh, heat seeker right here. The heat seeker is awesome. This has infrared panels that heat up when your body moves. It catches the sun. Uh, there's a few subtle differences in the wetsuit. The heat seeker has the flash bomb lining throughout. The um, the zipless one has flash bomb only on the body, not on the arms. And the one with the chest zip also has flash bomb lining throughout. Still talking flash bomb. And we've got the heat seeker inside out. And if you look closely, the heat seeking panels are the brighter pink. And they actually heat up when your body moves. They do get really warm when the sun's on them too. This is a super warm suit. What I really love is you've got flash bomb tape throughout the whole thing and you do have flash bomb lining throughout the whole wetsuit like I mentioned before. It's just a really good suit, really toasty warm. I'm going to Victoria this year, I'm looking forward to trying it over there. So that's that one, the heat seeker. Moving on, we've got my good mate Sam here giving us a hand. He's a bit of a legend around these parts. This is the chest zip one. The same as the heat seeker, it does have the flash bomb taping throughout and it is head to toe flash bomb on the inside. What it doesn't have is the heat seeking panels obviously because it's not a heat seeking model. So that's probably the second warmest of the bunch, the third option. This is the zip free flash bomb. Um, what's good about this one is it's not flash bomb throughout. Sometimes you do want a slightly cooler wetsuit, especially if you're surfing heats or if you're doing that quick dash to get a couple of ways before you get to work. You want to paddle around like a headless chook, this is a great wetsuit. All three of them are awesome. Now if you want to run me through how to take that on. Hey, Sam here. So first of all, we're just unzipping it at the chest. And we're going to pull it over our head. Once that's over, take your left arm off first. Because it's a bit more stretchy around this part here. So pull it over, get it over both our shoulders and pull it a bit further down. Don't force anything, just be careful with the neoprene. And once you've got it to your hands, get your left one out first, and then your right, and then you're ready to pull it over and off. 